Hi, I'm Sam from Power Developers, and welcome to Develop with HMS Core. Today, I'm going to show you how to integrate Huawei HealthKit, which provides a platform to users to store their fitness and health data. It also provides a wide range of APIs for writing and reading workout speed, positioning, blood sugar level, and other data. Huawei HealthKit enables you and your users to agree on what data can be accessed, guaranteeing proper use and security of personal data. Currently, Huawei HealthKit is available in over 170 countries and regions across the globe. So, let's see how to integrate Huawei HealthKit into your app. To start, go to Health Code Lab on the Huawei Developers website. The Code Lab provides a basic third party app development example. So, all you need to do is complete the corresponding code fragment to achieve the function of real time step counting. This function displays the real time step count curve, step frequency, total number of steps, and calories burnt on the UI. Open Android Studio and import the downloaded sample project. Then, on the official website of Huawei Developers, go to Console, Huawei App Gallery, select My Apps, click New and enter the relevant information to create a project. Click the Develop tab. In the dialog box that appears, enter the app package name configured in Android Studio and click Save. Once you've done that, click Overview and download the AG Connect Services JSON file. Go back to the console page and click HealthKit under Development to access its management page. Click Apply in the upper right corner. Fill in the related app information and select the required permissions, then click Submit. After your application is approved, you'll be able to access the HealthKit capabilities. After that, move the downloaded AG Connect Services JSON file to the app directory, open the build Gradle file and add the Huawei Maven repository. Open the build Gradle file in the app directory and add the Huawei High Health Dependency to Dependencies. Add the app signing configurations. Open Android Manifest file and set metadata for App ID so that it is the same as the App ID you have applied for on the Huawei Developers website. Next, add the login method to the High Health Setup class in the project package and use Huawei ID Auth Manager for login requests. Add the listener code for real time listening to the high health base adapter and add Huawei ID initialization client information to where to do client is located. Then add the listener registration coding fragment to where to do start is located and add the listener initialization coding fragment to where to do listener is located. Finally, Add the listener unregistration coding fragment to where to do stop is located. And there you have it. The code has been compiled. Let's run the demo to try it out. A login window will appear when running the app for the first time. Touch the start button to start reading the real time step count data. The number of steps will increment by one each time your phone shakes. The real time step count curve, step frequency, total number of steps, and calories burnt are displayed on the UI. When you're finished, touch the stop button to stop reading. Well, there you go. You've now integrated Huawei HealthKit into your app. If you have any questions, you can leave them in the comments area below or visit the Huawei Developers website. And be sure to hit the subscribe button. Thanks for watching.